Hello everyone, in this video I will tell you how to use templates in Zoho campaigns, how to use the already pre-designed templates and to create your own. To see all of the email templates, you have to click library in the menu and go to email templates. Press the button create using and now let's go and see what pre-made templates Zoho provides for you. First of all, we can see all of the welcome email templates. You can use these templates to welcome your clients that signed up for your newsletters or for your special programs. Then you can also see deals and offers email templates. For example, offers for Thanksgiving, Black Friday, some different sales, Cyber Mondays and Christmas sales. And as you can see, all of these email templates can suit for different types of businesses. Next templates are for holidays greetings, for example, for Halloween, Christmas, Easter, and some Indian celebrations. And scrolling down, you can see that there is a wide range of different holidays email templates. Next pre-made templates are newsletters. As you know, they are pretty popular in B2B and B2C market. And also there's some templates for surveys, different webinars and thank you letters and also for different seasons. This is basically also templates for different holidays, for example, Mother's Day or St. Patrick Day. There's also some Halloween templates too. You can also send your customers a happy birthday note and there's also a selection of emergency and crisis templates. Most of them are COVID-19 related. So as you can see, Zoho provides a wide selection and range of different pre-made templates and they're all fully customizable. I will show you how to customize and how you can change different elements in the pre-made template that you chose. First of all, you need to choose a template that you want to customize. I chose this Thanksgiving one. Then you need to name it and the editor of the template is opening up. So as you can see, this email template is consisting of different elements. Uh, for example, the photo, you can change it. You can change the background color of it. As you can see, Zoho Campaigns supports a GIF format of images and that can make your email campaign actually stand out. The other elements of this template include logo and text. And as you can see, the greeting of the customer is already personalized. So the name will change according to the name that is in the email list. There is the text of the letter and also the footer of the letter. So you can fully change this template. You can write your own text. You can put down your um, logo and also change the picture if you want. You can add photo from the library or use the stock image. And again, you can fully customize this template. You can change the color of the footer fully and change other elements really easily. I will show you how the elements work and how you can change them and add them in the basic templates. And with that knowledge, you will know how to change the pre-made templates and also create your own. And now let's move on to basic templates. So there is a fully blank templates and also other templates with different layouts of text, images and logo. To show you how all of the elements and tools in Zoho Campaign's template builder work, I will use the blank template. First of all, I press save as template and then we name it. This email template will be for the Black Friday sale. I know that there are some pre-made templates, but Black Friday is coming, so I decided to use this theme. As you can see, the editor is already opening up. And now you can see the fully blank canvas for your emails. You can choose the different layouts on this stage too. And then also the design of your canvas, the color of the actual email, the background color of the email. There's also some patterns that you can put on the background. Here, as you can see, you can also change the color of the background of the template. And I will choose black because we're making a Black Friday email campaign. Here you can also add the border and edit the color of it and the size of it. I'm choosing the red one so you can actually see it, but we won't use it in this email template. 
Let's go back to layouts. I will show you how they look. For example, we choose the one. You can fully edit it and also move the elements around. You can add another layout. So if you choose one, it doesn't mean that you can't use another one on top of that. And again, you can customize all of the layouts, add different pictures, customize the bottoms, add the headings, personalize the headings and fully customize this template. But as I said, we will make the email template from scratch. Here you can see the blank template. We will add the image. There's different layouts of image, but I will choose the one that will be a banner image. Let's choose this GIF that says Black Friday and moves around. You can also put it like to the feet or banner type. I prefer the banner because it fills out all of the space. And you can also fill out the space by changing the background of the image, for example, to the black. Let's change the text. There's three types of sizes of the text, like a heading and the body of the text one, but I will choose the other type of text. This is a box text, so you can change the color of the box where there's a text and also change the font, make the text bold or in italic, change uh, the layout of the text. To change the color of the box, you go to edit and then choose the color of the box. And there are some other settings for the boxed text. Now let's personalize this email. And to do that, you have to press the button merge tags. Here you can see different values of the tags. So for example, it's an email address, the first or last name of the customer, and it will change according to the data that you put in your mailing list. So for example, it will change to Emily, save on everything, or like George, save on everything. And that is a great feature because as you know, personalization of email campaigns is the key to their success. So now the header of the email is done. And now let's make the email itself. I choose the image plus text and you can see different layouts. I will choose the one that has the image on the left and text on the right. Here you can write your own text and change it with the text editor. And now let's upload our picture. Again, you can upload it from the library of the files, upload it from the computer. And also Zoho Campaigns provides stock pictures that you can use for free. So here we have our picture and let's choose the banner size. I actually want to add text on top of the picture. So let's press edit. And here you can add the text on the picture. I want to write the discount, for example, minus 40% on the shoes. So here you can write the text. You can again edit it with the text editor. I want it to stand out a bit more, so I will make it boxed. I also moved the sneakers to the right side and made the background of the image in black. And I will show you how to do it with another image example. And now let's add text and edit it. I don't like that the image and text elements are very close to the box text. So I will add a very useful element and it's a spacer. It will give a little bit of space and I can move it around in different places. And you can see that I placed it under the box text and it looks much more neat. And you can also change the size of it. Obviously we need a call to action. So let's add a button. You can choose any type of it because we will change it. And you can drag it to the place that you need your button to be seen. You can add a text and URL and also change the design of the button. Again, you can change the color of it. We will make it black. You can change the font of the button's text and obviously change the way it looks, the size of it. You can make it square with rounded corners, oval or customize the way it looks. You can also add borders and basically design the way you want the button to look. This is actually a big advantage of Zoho campaigns and Zoho apps in general because they are usually fully customizable. And again, you can change the call to action, but we will leave the get now. And now let's add another picture. And as I already told you, I will show you how I drag it to the right side and also change the canvas color to the black so it looks neat. We added all of our pictures and text. Now we can copy the button that we added and drag it to another text box. We can also change the layout so we can make the pictures bigger and take more space than a text or vice versa. 
and you can also add dynamic content to your email templates for example pictures pictures and text words or a button you can set up rules for example if the name the company the last name um, is some kind of value there will be a button shown only for certain people that will receive this campaign. You can also add other rules, for example, like if and else if and else rules. Another useful element is a divider to divide the parts of your email. Uh, I will change the color of the divider to black because it's black theme. Dividers are often used to divide the email and the footer and in the footer we will place the social media links. Here you can add different social medias and you can also add a custom icon of, for example, a website. We will add some social medias that we use, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, YouTube and Instagram. You can make it in the central position and also change the way icons look we have everything in black so we will change it to this minimalistic design and you can also remove the names of the social medias and leave only the icons of them now we can save this email template and we will find it in all of the templates library now it's time to create a campaign. We already made a video on how you can make a campaign in Zoho campaigns. So make sure to click the link in the up right corner to check how you can do it in only five minutes. And that's how our email looks. I'm not a designer, so please don't judge me. And that's why Zoho made pre-made templates. Thank you, Zoho, for that. So even if you don't have designer skills, you can still make powerful campaigns. And if you have the designer skills, you have a fully customizable tool that will suit your needs and have different elements that you can create powerful email templates with. Thank you for watching and make sure to subscribe to our channel. We make videos every week sharing different business, marketing, sales and other tips.